Hello. So today I'm looking at Spitfire Audio Symphony Orchestra, the BBC one, um, and I'm loading up a number of patches in Cubase. And you can see I've got one, two, three, four, five instances of Spitfire Audio Symphony Orchestra loaded. Um, I've loaded up in the pro mode and I've loaded our patch one is some violins. On channel two, if I load the interface here, we've got a flute. I'm just going to close that one down. Uh, in channel three, we've got a cellist. Beautiful. In channel four, we've got a tenor trombone. And finally, in channel five, we've got a bass clarinet. So as I said, I'm using this in the pro mode because memory isn't a problem at the moment and I'm just loading up everything into, uh, into RAM and playing it on the computer. But let's just say I was a little bit strapped for memory and I wanted to change the mode of these to the discover mode or to the core mode just so I could get on with some work and maybe then revert them back to the pro mode at the end of the creative process. So I could uh, quite simply go through each of these individual plugins and change the mode from pro to core or to discover. That's a bit tedious. So what I can do is in the one instance, I'm just going to choose these violins here, I can click on the drop down and choose core. Now you'll see the grey interface has appeared. And I'm now on the core version. Now, this little button here is a refresh button, but if I right click on this and choose switch all instances to core, clickly, clickly, click, everything's done it. Now I go to the second instance, which before was a flute in the pro, is now a flute in the core, which is brilliant. Down here, trombone, tenor trombone in the core version. The same works for discovery. If I click on discover, right click on the refresh and go switch all instances to discover. Now, if I go down to track three, the cellist is now loaded into the discover mode. Really useful, um, a great way of quickly saving memory if things are getting a little bit tight and you just uh, don't care about the advanced features or the advanced functionality of the pro version. So there we are, that's how you switch modes in uh, Spitfire Audio BBC Symphony Orchestra.